Hi, it's Tim Hagen from Progress Coaching, and welcome to another episode of Coaching Conversations. And I wanted to make you aware of something very cool that we're doing on a subscription basis, and we'll put a link in each one of our episodes. But every Wednesday, we're going to be doing what we call an audio podcast workshop. That workshop will be roughly about 14 to maybe 20 minutes per episode with each month having the theme from a coaching model, using feedback strategically to coaching self-awareness and so on. So if you could look in the body or in the content description of each episode, and you will see a link where you can join this subscription. These are literally four workshops every month teaching specific strategies to address a particular area of workplace coaching uh, as it relates, again, to things like awareness, motivation, teamwork, and what have you. Here's the cool thing. It's only $10 per month, and each month you will get a handout that we will follow along with, so we also give you a tool for you to take notes as we go through each episode. We hope you'll check it out. With everything going on in the world, one of the most unique opportunities companies like ours have is to, for lack of better description, reinvent itself. When I think about the coaching and the training space, wow, has it been disrupted. I mean, you're seeing everybody and anybody on LinkedIn talking about being, you know, virtual training, virtual coaching experts. And recently I had a call from a company saying, we can help you go online. And let me make a very bold comment. Going online is not as difficult as people are making it out to be. Yes, you who have a different dynamic. Yes, there are certain nuances that are challenging. Yes, it takes you out of the classroom and into the virtual world. And yet, that's the opportunity right now. We can't fight that because who knows when we're going to get back in the classroom. So we had a client come to us and say, geez, you know, we're really struggling. Um, we want to keep our people's minds fresh and intact with what we need to do. We want them to engage as good teammates, engage with their customers, but we don't want to go online do you have any ideas? And I said, well, what do you mean? They said, oh, we just love your lessons that you send out to us monthly. And all of a sudden I thought, you know, we used to do this a while ago and we got away from it like anything. It's, you know, one of 14,000 things you're doing and that's digital coaching. Now, what is digital coaching? Digital coaching is where a digital asset is provided, whether it's a multimedia, whether it's a link to an article, a video, um, an animation, whatever it might be, and it prompts thought. It prompts someone to build self-awareness. It potentially prompts people to take action. So we're working with this company, and we're working with a customer service area. And what we did is we sent out four lessons in a month, such as what are you going to do to really overwhelm your customers with kindness, and what is the benefit to you, what is the benefit to the customer, and what is the benefit to the organization? So after about four weeks, we sent out these lessons, about three to five minutes, and we ended up sending out these lessons, and our customer called and said, I have to tell you, it's really cool. I'm noticing a major difference. I said, wow, that's great. So it was about 16 to maybe 20 minutes worth of content, but each lesson came with an accountability sheet, something they would fill out. And so as we started to talk more and more, I said, well, what are you noticing? Well, they're more upbeat, they're more energetic, they're trying to win over customers, they're really making great attempts. Certainly we have a ways to go. Would you be willing to do this as a service? I said, sure. And so the idea behind digital coaching is something that this client said to me that I'll never forget. He said, you know, it's interesting because when our people are filling out those sheets, the accountability activity sheets, I said, yeah. And he said, you're coaching them. And I said, yeah, I, I am using coaching questions. He goes, it's awesome. You're scaling yourself across the organization. You're scaling what Progress Coaching does. Now, before anyone thinks this is this infomercial, uh, maybe it is a little bit, but it certainly gives you an idea of where we're going as an industry, not just us as a company. We have got to get creative. So if you're interested in learning more about digital coaching, I'm going to put my email address down and we are launching a service, and this was always part of our plan. And it's a service that is provided to um, organizations on a fixed cost, unlimited basis, meaning once they sign up, they can send out the lessons and the activity sheets to as many people as they want. It's private labeled to the company. It's very, very cool in terms of the activity sheets, meaning that when you send out the activities, it looks like the company's actually created it. There is no progress coaching uh, logo 
lingo, uh, promotional materials, it's 100% educational. So with that being said, you know, digital coaching is about using digital assets. And with digital assets, it should really prompt thought provocation, critical thinking, next steps, actions people can take, and really reflection. And when you have people fill out what I call accountability activity sheets, which again, as my customer noted, are coaching questions, such as what have you learned about yourself? What are you going to do next? What's the value of you doing this? What do you think this will do for you personally? How do you think this will help the customer? By answering those questions, which again are a form of coaching questions, we are putting coaching on autopilot. So if you're thinking about a non-virtual solution, it certainly doesn't have to be us. Think about creating a digital coaching platform, a platform that targets your business imperatives, that uses digital assets to raise eyebrows and accountability activity sheets to get people to take action. Thank you for listening to another episode of Coaching Conversations by Tim Hagen and Progress Coaching. Now, our company is always coming out with new and innovative solutions to help leaders coach their employees. And recently, we just created a new service called coach to You, where leaders can pick and choose topics and assign 7 to 21-day programs for employees to learn and, more importantly, apply actions and then reflect and share what they're going to do going forward as a result of the learning. It's called coach to You. We're literally bringing coaching to your employees. If you're intrigued, we'll have a link in each one of our episodes where you can get more information. And again, thank you so much for listening to another episode.